Hey, this is Darren with Big Daddy Scripts. I am going to show you the screenshot cam with custom MLOs and things in your server. A lot of times the Rockstar editor will not work. And I know a lot of people rely on that for screenshots that have a little more depth and a little more control. So I created this to sort of be a go between for that. It's not going to work exactly like it. You can't record a thing in game and then figure out a screenshot in it. But what we can do, I'm going to come right around in here. And I'm going to open up the screenshot cam. And what this is, it allows me to have complete control over the camera while my player just stands there. So I can move it back and forth. I can change the field of view and you can see the numbers there on the screen. And the controls are listed there at the bottom. The mouse lets you rotate. So I'm trying to get here where I can show the depth of field control. Um, so I'm going to crank up the depth of field strength to about 0.98. I like it about there. When you go all the way, it's too much. And if you drop too much below that, it, it drops quickly. So I usually keep it up pretty high. You see the red and yellow lines. That's the, uh, the near and the far focal spot of the depth of field. So what's in between the red and yellow is what will be in focus. So it's obviously close to us. And so I'm going to move the far one behind him. And you can see it move. It goes to the ground up into the air. So if I move it behind him and then I move this one up close to him, as I move past, you see he goes out of focus. So it's in focus between those two. So again, I'm going to crank it up a little higher just so you can see. And those stay on the screen for five seconds while you're editing. Like if I change anything there, it'll stay there for five seconds or as long as I'm changing it. So as you go down, it goes down quick. But it, it all depends on how much blur you really want. Like if I set it right around in there. It looks pretty decent, but we tend to like to crank it up <laughs> and make it a little stronger. And remember, everything between the red and the yellow, that's what's in focus. And then it goes out of focus as it gets out past that. So you have control over all of that. You can angle any way you want. And the uh, field of view, the FOV, is your mouse wheel. So you can shrink that field of view. It's basically like a zoom. But it does get into, once you get into the larger numbers, it's, this is like super wide angle. <laughs> Nobody's ever going to use that, but. And you can hit the left alt and it goes into pause mode, which means I can now move around if I want to. And reposition myself or start an emote or whatever. Then you hit left alt again and it brings it back. If I hit H, all the text goes away and now I can take my screenshot. Hit H again and come back. If I hit X, it goes out and I'm back to the game. Uh, once you hit X, if you go back in, it starts all over again. So it does not remember. You have to make sure you're ready to leave whenever you do leave. And that's it. That's how the thing works. Let's say we're in a vehicle. Mm -hmm. 
So we're in a vehicle. It's going to be the same deal. Now I have a shot of the vehicle. So yeah, it's not Rockstar Editor, but it uh, gets you a little closer and lets you take some good screenshots with some depth of field to them and uh, be able to change the, the field of view and uh, you know, kind of get it set up the way that you want. So hopefully that's a big help. Anyway, that's it. Thanks for watching. BigDaddyScripts.com